We're not doing it. We want to look cute for the rest of the night. I'm trying out the new lens that I got for my camera. Oh, I'm watching my guava. Look at the way. I don't know if y'all can see. This is Aaliyah. I love her channel. I love her. Period. Um, she's so fun. Anyways, um, I just got back from dinner and I wanted to try out the camera a little bit just to see um if i could tell the difference in the quality i heard so much I, you guys don't care anyways um i know what fragrance did i wear to dinner tonight um oh my gosh you guys you want to know what fragrance i have been absolutely hands down loving in the den and it isn't that big but i have absolutely been loving this fragrance hold on let me get it okay i'm back I slept in this lotion. I mean, this. Well, I slept in this lotion. I don't know. I slept in this lotion, and I slept in this fragrance like three nights in a row. And that's unlike me because I tell myself that I need to change my fragrances every single day, sometimes two, three times a day, because I have so many and I want to use them. I told you I'm all about making dents in my bottles this year. Um, but I have been sleeping in Rouge Smoking, and I've been wearing it like crazy for the last few days. Let's see if it autofocus or how the autofocus is on it oh did that take a long time it seemed like it took a minute to me um let's put it there not too shabby okay um but yeah and i absolutely love this it smells like a cherry dr pepper kind of has reminisce of killian's angel shears not really you guys but really in the same family kind of has a little bit reminisce of um what else does it have reminisce of? Oh God, uh, love don't be shy. It's like in that family. Oh God, it's so good. Yeah, I may sleep in this again. I might sleep in this again. It's been so good. So I've been getting out of the shower. I've been uh, cleansing myself with the Rihanna Fenty Cocoa Butter. It's not cocoa butter. The cocoa bar. You know, the bar that I showed you guys. The, the cleansing bar. That thing can set like nobody's business. And then a scrub. I got a new scrub from Oil of Olay, which is really good. And then a body conditioner for after the scrub. It's really good, you guys. Okay. And so then I was putting on this. This is a... Let's try it out again. So de Janeiro. This is the Bum Bum Cream. This is the yellow one. The Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. This is so good. Oh, and I also slept in the fragrance that goes to this one night as well. Oh my gosh, but this and this, chef's kiss. Who's there? Hello? I just be in here talking and people be walking through and I'm like, hello, excuse you. Anyways, um, but yeah, this smells really good. So I have just been, oh, 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 and I wanted to share this lotion with you guys. I got this, um, I told you I've been on my whole Killian good girl gone bad. Every now and then I just get on that kick and I just want to wear that fragrance like crazy. So a couple of days ago, I guess this is like what I've been wearing, what I've been reaching for kind of fragrance. And I'm doing it from the comfort of my closet and my PJs. And you guys, please don't look around because it's a mess in here. Stop looking. Don't look over there. It's a mess. I haven't had a chance. I just walked in the door. You know how it is when you get dressed, you go through stuff, you try on clothes, you try on bags, shoes, everything. And it's like, I don't want to wear this. I don't want to wear this. I kept taking stuff off and starting over. But anyways, yeah, I've been wearing um, Killian Good Girl Gone Bad Like Crazy. I picked this lotion up. Oh, come on, thing. Are you focusing? Because I know you're not going to act like this. I guess you do have a little bit of a, um, I guess you do have a little bit of a, a glare because of the bottle. But yeah, I picked this up on the Killian website. It had went on sale or something. And I picked it up and I was like, oh, am I still in focus? And I was like, oh my gosh, okay, I gotta have it. Because I love the lotion. I mean, the, the fragrance so much. I have the four vials of the fragrance. I don't have the full size bottle. But once those run out, I'm gonna get the full size bottle. And I'm debating if I'm gonna get the, um, the Good Girl Gone Bad. I think there's, is, is it fresh or like straight I don't know or the original one they both smell really good oh 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 my gosh oh my gosh I wore this combo to the Kendrick Lamar concert grow guys say less let me show you what it was okay okay I'm back I had to bring everything over here so Kendrick's concert right I had a lot of different options I was gonna go with I was gonna wear 
Baccarat 540. We already know because I'm like, it's bougie, it's rich. I want to give all the vibes, all the thrills, all the feels. But then I said, I don't want to get there and then I can't smell myself because then I'm not going to be able to have a memory tied to the concert. And so then I was like, okay, so we're not wearing that. I was going to wear Creative Vintage for her, but it was kind of like too bossy. I really didn't want to be that girl that night. You know, you got to set your fragrance with your mood, your outfit. It all has to go together. The hair. So I wore my hair straight. I'll be putting pictures up somewhere. And there's a vlog too. So whichever you see first this or the vlog but anyway so I wore my hair straight I wore a bold red lip I wore all black um I think I did I wear texture or material what did I and what bag did I carry oh I carried my Chanel uh walk so I did carry that and then I had on cute heels they weren't too high I should have wore my Fenty heels but I didn't know if they were going to be comfortable or not so I didn't want to risk it so I wore these other heels they were okay but um the fragrance I had the hardest time choosing the fragrance because I was going to go with um Delina and then I'm like I'm definitely not trying to be that girl like I you know I had on all black I had my sunnies on at night yes girl at night okay um so I wasn't trying to be pretty foo foo la la I was just trying to be like catch a vibe hello excuse you yes <laughs> yes I was trying to be her right you guys I first showered with all of the stuff that I told you I showered with I did a nice um scrub in the shower at the hotel um, and then I put this on my body. This is the Coco Cabana uh, Bronze Glow Oil, and I believe it's by Sol de Janeiro, right? Am I making that up? Am I making that up? No, 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 it is. Okay, so it looks like this. I'll link everything in the description box below, but I do want to check this and see how this is picking up and reading. Is it doing it? Okay, a little bit. Not too shabby, but okay. So anyways, yeah, so I put this on, and you know I use my big pom-pom brush i doused this all because i had shoulders out guns out shoulders out okay it was it's still summer here it's still summer so i glazed it all up and it didn't look greasy it looked kind of like bronzy and then i had a tad bit of shimmer because i did put on my um soleil blanc um, the body shimmer just a tad bit of it just for a little bit of uh, shimmer um, on the decollete like right here at the clavicle um, and then i put some down by my ankles i love when the feet and the ankles are highly moisturized yes highly emphasis on moisturized so I put some down there and then I put on this lotion I don't know why I just said I'm wearing this tonight this is a combo that I want to wear I put on the body lotion and this is Cassiopeia by Tinsiana Terenzi um I was sent this by the brand you guys can't see it sorry I'll link it down below but anyways yeah I was sent this over and I was like yes I'm definitely taking it it was travel size I was able to put it in my my travel bag it fit in there easy peasy it's really cute it's even good for like a nice hand lotion it's really really cute and it's very scented it's very scented you can pick this up at so avant-garde you can use my discount code and get 20% off right now a lot of you are asking when is the next 30% off I am not sure yet but as soon as I know you know I'm gonna let you know you already know so anyways the fragrance was are you ready oh my god you guys what's loud what's powerful what's bold what's strong what's sexy what's that girl but still that girl but still that girl you know what I mean strict Nina I'm not gonna hold you I'm not gonna hold you I'm not gonna keep you I wouldn't do that to you strict Nina you can pick this up too so at Vanguard 20% off everything's gonna be linked in the description box below if you know you know somebody might be saying Shrey oh my god oh this is strict Nemo I knew this wasn't the right one where's strict Nina Oh, I had it on the other side because I was using it. They look just alike though, right? I mean, they look alike. But anyways, I knew it wasn't because when I took the cap off, I'm like, mm, you didn't hit the same. This right here, oh my gosh. So somebody might be saying, Shrey, why did you choose this? Why did you wear this? This is loud. This is bold. This is strong. This is sexy. This is going to stay on your body forever and ever and ever. You are not going to have to wonder what happened to your fragrance. Did it disappear? Did it leave where you at? Girl, I was riding with you. What happened? The wheels didn't come off, but you left. It wasn't that kind of fragrance. This fragrance is going to be with you to the wee hours of the night, to two, three, four o'clock in the morning where you're going out to brunch. You didn't even go home. You just went right from wherever you were at, and then you just kept rolling, and you went into brunch the next day. This fragrance is going to ride with you. Yes, it's that strong. It's that potent. It's that, dang, I'm going to need a new bottle. 
It's good, good. This right here I have been talking about for a minute now. I wear this winter, spring, summer, fall. It does not matter. This fragrance performs. It holds up. If I had a 10 out of a 10 list that I made for just fragrances that can just get the job done, a one and done, you don't even really have to overspray, but I do because it's just me. This would be on the list. This is fire. This is fire in a bottle. So this is what I have been reaching for. Um, nothing new i have been wearing prada paradox um you know out daytime but i mean i have been away and those are the ones that i took on vacation so now that i am back home i have been reaching for oh my gosh some of my favorites and this strychnina by quinticano you need this in your life if you have it drop a comment down below if you want to try it drop a comment down below um, if you want to shop it, shop it so at Vanguard and use that 20% off. This is good, good. Uh, oh, 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 and this, this. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my. Oh, and I have been wearing Mind Games. If you follow me on Instagram, I told you guys about that. I don't have them in here or there in the other room because I'm going to do another video on them and talk about them tomorrow. But I wore Checkmate. I'll pop a picture up. To the gym, big mistake. I was running. I was on the Stairmaster. It was purring like nobody's business. It was a beast it was so hot so heavy but so good oh you talking about sexy that's not a gym fragrance i'm just gonna say that's not a gym fragrance and it probably was a little too warm but i was anxious i get that way when i get a new fragrance i'm like oh my god i want to wear it i want to wear it yeah i should have worn but anyways another one that i have been reaching for like crazy i shared this with you guys i know one thing about me i'm loyal i'm faithful if i like something i like it i'm gonna talk about it again again and again it is not the newest person or the newest fragrance that's going to get the most love in my collection. It's what I'm really reaching for. And what I reach for is what, you know, um, or what makes me reach for something is how it makes me feel or how I want to feel. It depends on what mood I'm in. And I've been in this mood lately. I've been in a soft girl, sexy, kind of bad girl, kind of sassy kind of vibe. And he's right here. They've been getting a job done. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. They have been making me feel how I want to feel. And Tibet is that girl, okay? If you that guy, he's that guy. She's that girl. Tibet is a unisex fragrance. Man, woman, boy, child, human can pull up and rock this fragrance. I'm just saying everything is going to be leaked in the description box, you guys. This really just started out as a demonstration video. I don't even know if I'm going to post it, but if I do post it, I'm going to leave that in there so that you can see the relaxed feel of the video it was very chill i'm just actually trying to try out this camera lens just to see maybe i should make it darker um like i said we had just gotten in from dinner it was so good to go out and hang out with my mom and my dad and see them it's always good to see them we always link up and celebrate birthdays and have a really good time so it was really nice to do that i am so grateful to god because um yeah uh, are we about to testify? No, 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 we're not doing it. We're not doing it. We want to look cute for the rest of the night. We're not about to start crying. We got on mascara. We got on a little lashes. But just know that God is good. And um, according to doctors, both my parents should not be here today. But um, all glory be to God. They are both still here, alive, able, willing, and kicking. And at times on my last nerves. Hello. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. <laughs> just, just saying hi guys <laughs> t tr truth telling over here just truth telling i'm just saying but anyways yeah i'm done i just wanted to pop on here and see how the camera quality was doing but uh, if i can get a video and some content out of it i'm gonna do it and if i could talk about fragrance and share it with you guys i'm gonna do it and it was so fun because it was so relaxed oh, oh oh another thing you guys were asking me in the last video and probably in this vlog that you're gonna see the lip that i'm wearing Oh, did I show you in the vlog? Yeah, in the vlog I shared with you. But in case I didn't, you guys, this is the lip by Gwen Stefani that she came out with. I think it was like um, something she came out with Sephora. I don't know. I tried some reds. I knew I was going to the concert and I wanted a bold red lip. I typically wear Fenty Stunna um, by Rihanna. This one here, I typically wear Fenty Stunna, but I wanted something just a little different. I don't know why. Did I need something different? No. Some things in life are not needs. You know, they're just wants. So this is Fenty Stunna. This is what I typically wear, and it's a beautiful one. I'll show you it because it wouldn't make sense if I didn't show you, but I'm not putting it on. Oh, my God, that's so pretty. I want to go out now. Um, but I wore this one by Gwen Stefani to the concert, and it was really nice, too. It's the one that looks like this. They had these going all over in Sephora. You were able to see it. I think it's called Me, You, Yours. Yeah, Me, You, Yours. And um, let me swatch this one and show you what this one looks like. The texture of it is very... It needs to dry. So that's 
that's the color of them there this one is the one by Gwen Stefani and then this one is the one by Rihanna um let me see if I take it down uh that was real dark I know camera oh so that was you focusing okay okay so yeah so this one here is Gwen Stefani and then this one over here is Rihanna let me see if I could do it a little it, this one um by Rihanna has a little bit more of a blue base girl I don't know why you saying that like you really know but I'm thinking so um if you look there it has a little bit more of a blue base and then or does this one you guys, I don't know. I don't know, okay? But these are the two colors. This is the one, like I said, I just put that fresh coat there. They're both really pretty, though. So, yeah. Um, okay, that was too bright. During the holidays, I'm really a red girl. Like, I love a red lip. It's just very bold, very simple eye. Um, a, a, an extravagant cat eye. I, I Forget it. I haven't did my makeup in my own mirror in so long. That my cat eye has been looking like crazy it really has I'm sorry I need something to wipe this off my cat eye has been looking crazy my whole makeup routine has just been a little different because I've been doing it in hotels and you know how you don't have your stuff like I take my travel bag with me but my makeup looks best when I do it at home every now and again when I'm traveling and I'm out and they have a nice you know mirror and natural lighting that you're able to see your makeup I can get it done right but most times it's like girl like what are we doing so yeah but um yeah I, I'm, I'm looking forward to doing my makeup in my own mirror and I'm also looking forward to uh, God willing the holidays coming content that I want to do for uh, vlogmas should I do vlogmas this year you know I'm gonna do something but I don't know if it's gonna be like the whole 31 days or 26 or however long it is but it's definitely gonna be something and you know it's gonna be fun and fabulous dwellings of course but I think that's it you guys um this was so fun this was so fun to just come home and just talk to you guys I love that I love when that happens like I said it started off as a uh trying out the camera but it turned into a whole video and if i like it i'm gonna post it if i don't you won't see it nonetheless thanks for listening i will see you beautiful souls in the next one i hope everyone is doing well until next time besties you know the drill wait a minute who's calling me oh it's 10 30. that's the alarm that's the goal time that i have set to go to bed it don't ever happen though but anyways until next time you know the drill be blessed stay fit and definitely stay fabulous dwellings thanks for watching bye